let's go. Let's go. Let's go. You know what, <laughs> Mount's right. We haven't earned the let's go yet. Oh. You know what I just thought of? Mm. Let's go. <laughs> like a foghorn. Chariot. Oh! oh. <laughs> That's where it ends. Wait, wait, wait. It's to be like, let's go, sweet 40 squad. I'm coming. Oh, how about this one? Fat oh, bottle okay. sips, you make the black and world go. <laughs> oh. That's unrelated, but also great. Yeah. <laughs> I could I can get with that. It's gotta be that. Can I can I say something about about the squad right now? Can I hit you with a line real quick first? Yeah. Shooting Houston. up to dab on your foes. <laughs> the best I could come up with there. All right, hear me out here. Uh -huh. Yeah, I, I give ourselves a unification of a B minus. Mm. Okay. I actually believe that is fair. Uh, I, I crunch the numbers. We operate like B plus to A plus. It's and fair, it's, but uh, why are you testing my unification by going? This I would love to go to snobby, and I did. I clicked on snobby initially, but I think it's a little far from this bus. My personal you opinion. Yeah, but like I wanna, I wanna put boots on the ground. Oh, okay, let's go. <laughs> I'm feeling good about this one. Dude, no, again, Anarchy's home field advantage. Yeah. yeah. Well, battle bus that goes to Anarchy, that's like the Detroit Lions playing the Green Bay <laughs> Packers week one. You can't say home field advantage because last time we went here, you were like, help, help me, help me. Well, I, I, went, I broke both silos. One silo was empty. The other silo had four bandages. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? <laughs> a zero gun <laughs> silo is like, you know, that's like Aaron Rodgers breaks his arm throwing a ladder. Never happens. I'm going to the big house. I All think right. we're solo boys. No, there's a pretty sure company. Yeah? I thought I saw it, guys, but. I didn't see any. That's wild. And I was behind you guys. Mm. There's a great uh, tacty in stables if anybody's like super dire. I figured it was going to be spicy as hell. Do you have any gray poupons? Mm, dude, I, I do. In my refrigerator. I've really? never had gray poupon. I've only ever heard of it about it in the world. Well, I mean, it's like... Exactly. It's just Dijon mustard. It's not oh, like, it's just Dijon mustard. Yeah, it's not like even like... It's not uh, fancy mustard. It's just different. Gotcha. gotcha. Best my personal of... opinion, there okay. can't be such thing as a fancy mustard. No well, such thing as a fancy mustard? Like hand milled mustard. Okay, that I'll give you that. So I was I went to like this uh this beer place the other day. Nice. And uh they do a huge uh Belgian pretzel with beer cheese, oh. but also whole grain uh in house made mustard. Of course. And that's some fancy mustard, man. That I mean, is a I, fancy mustard. Yeah. I thought mustard came from mustard seed. Yeah, it's whole yes. grain seeds. So like when you're like you know, the mustard you get like these little mustard balls. Yeah, They're it's like great. it's brown and yellow, brown and yellow, brown and yeah, yeah, and it's yeah. clumped up like yo. Know, it's we used to in college we used to do this trivia night at the bar uh, near our house every Thursday, and if you won, there were like two possible grand prizes: hmm. a bottle of whole grain mustard <laughs> or oh, or a twenty dollar gift certificate. And sometimes we'd get the twenty dollar gift certificate and be like, I wish we got the mustard, dude. Because like, if you get the twenty dollar gift certificate, we're just gonna buy like two pitchers and yeah. then it's gone and it's not a bad time but you know the mustard that lasts like a, a month way. yeah yeah <laughs> i've never had great fun but i imagine the best thing about it is that it comes in a jar you got, you do have to get a knife dirty to use it but i mean sometimes that's like it's like getting dressed up to go out you know you're like it's part of the ceremony <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. can i get a, a huddle up i've got some oh guys mm. then don't you get optimal also spread gifts. and amounts I'm a I'm a bottle Dan. squirter personally. Dan huddle up. <laughs> Saves the dish. Hmm. Well then how do you spread it out over Dan your sandwich up. equally? I just squeeze it uh, appropriately. Well then it's not really ever equidistant. Okay, uh, here you go. Okay. Oh you <laughs> dick. Oh look at that. <laughs> that was pretty cool. That was That's cool. it. If anyone wants That's that. It. Uh, Actually, Daniel, rock, paper, scissors you for it. How do I rock, paper, scissors? <laughs> you lose. <laughs> That's how. Good, my God. 
there is a rock paper scissor remote in the game. Actually, is. that is a great way for us to decide things. Yeah, you we know what? We should next time lines. it pops up. Yeah. yeah. Save your save your V bucks. We'll pick that. Well, up. I've already got it. So. Oh, oh I didn't didn't buy realize. Realize. I mean, how convenient I, for you. I win every one. Yeah. I think we should use the orange justice dance to decide uh, things. Whoever uses the orange justice dance faster gets their way. <laughs> I feel like a mustard sandwich right now. I just want something mustard. Mustard. dude. Oh, I forgot I got cold cuts mustard today. Is oh. the best common condiment. I got black forest I ham. I'm gonna put some mustard on that shit. Please Why do. Why black I forest can't. ham? Why uh, can't it just be ham? It I, has I, that black like thing on the edge. Yeah, well, that's, that's the forest. black salt. <laughs> I think that's the forest, dude. Yeah, they it's rolled in the forest. <laughs> it's kind of forest, it's forest to dry with forest too, like like forest gum. Ah, forest rump. Oh, I see what you're doing. I feel like yellow mustard gets a bad rap because it's default. And Malph and I have had this discussion on many occasions. Ah. Uh, because it's like the default, like, oh. It is my oh, least mustard. favorite mustard. I have come back around to it. Really? You know what my least favorite kind of mustard is? What? And I'm not making any friends here. Honey? I'm not that big of a f Yeah, you got me. What, which one? Not that big of a fan of honey mustard. Ooh. I'm with you on Oh, that. hold on, boy. Like, I like my sweet and savory Where? stuff. I hit the shit. He's on the top of up. this house right Where? here. I nailed the hell out of him. That house that I'm at? Near like yes. tomato? Okay. Hey, boys, get your uh, challenges done here. I think he backpedaled off the other side of the roof at some point. Oh, there's one in the car in front of your house, Mouth. Nice. Job. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. One kill in Tomato Town. Oh, I would try to a pistol. I would have done that. <laughs> it's like honey mustard's good. Hmm. I would never turn it down. Here's the thing with honey mustard. I feel like you get some that just are packed with way too much sugar. Mm, yeah, I agree. You need like a nice, a nice rich honey mustard, you know? This one's going to blow your mind. Mm. So we bought kimchi, uh, and it's like, it's kind of legit kimchi. Like, it's imported. Uh -huh. But I ate it, and I was like, this kimchi tastes messed up. Like, it's way too sweet. Mm -hmm. Look at the ingredients list. It's got freaking sorbitol in it. <laughs> they used an Ooh. artificial sweetener in their pickled cabbage. That's wild. I was like, it tastes like literally it was like a Coke Zero. Yeah. It, it wasn't right. Yeah, it's brutal. I had I had something similar happen where one of the key ingredients was Splenda, and I was like, ugh, come on. Ugh. Was <laughs> the thing Splenda? No, it was like a it was some <laughs> kind of like a cookie or something. And immediately I was like, oh, this is like like disgustingly sweet and like a bad taste. Yeah, I don't like when diet foods yeah. are just bad foods with the bad parts replaced with slightly better stuff, but they taste way worse. Yeah, yeah. It's like a whole different type. It's like a whole different ballpark of bad. <laughs> like it's, it's, it, yeah, cause it, there's like an uncanny valley of badness. Yeah, yeah. So I just eat it like a, a carrot or something. That's what my biggest, like my biggest like, lifestyle shift has been cooking a lot and just staying mm. away from trying to stray from processed food as much as I can. I should, think it'll uh, serve you read well. Up on the paleo diet. It's I've seen all it. about. Yeah, it's all about. Ooh, what uh, is this marker. little marker right here? You got a little marker? Yeah, what is oh, that? This. Oh. Hey, I was reading that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's How about when you went vegan just to prove mouth? Oh no, we didn't go vegan. We went vegetarian. I was a vegetarian for a little bit. I'm not going to say it. It's the same Dude, thing. the difference between vegan and vegetarian is, is massive. Sub yeah. Substantially is massive. larger yeah. than the difference between like eating meat and being vegetarian. Vegan cuts out like tons of things. Yeah, Can't no eggs, anything. no cheese, no yogurt, yo, no sour cream, no milk, <laughs> no ice cream, no gelato. I mean, milk alone, it's like I, I cook with milk it's so often. And eggs and stuff. So you eat nothing that ever comes from an animal. Yeah, not right. nothing that's yeah. an animal byproduct. And it's it's kind of messed up to see how much, how many things have even small trace amounts of animal products in them. Oh, we got far to go. Like a lot of. Uh, hey, Mal. Beer is non-vegan. Yeah. Beer. Well, mm -hmm. beer. well. Is non-vegan. Correct. A lot of it. Yeah. A lot of it. Yeah. I Wait, think. come again? 
<laughs> do you want me to repeat the sentence or so there's animal products and beer is what you're saying in a lot of beer there can be animal products yeah what would they put in beer butter <laughs> if it's budweiser if it's, yeah. if it's budweiser they put in that deer urine yeah it's, what? A, deer, it's a deer urine additive a are derivative, you, I should say. Are you being serious? You guys memeing? It's a it's a derivative of deer urine they place in the beer. Ooh, we're getting shot in the back. For what purpose? Just to fuck people up, really. Oh, I see the guy. I see the guy. Uh, Just a mess. Yeah. yeah, I'm on route. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, he's gonna be like northwest of you guys. Guy oh, there's two. There's two. Yeah, yeah. I got knocked by the other. Oh, Three, maybe. oh, oh rock jerk it. move. Total jerk move. I hit him once. Oh, I'm getting oh, there's one more, up there. one more up there. Is that one of the ground still alive? Yep. Dang it. I'm on the way. Let's go, sack of potato. Nice. Sit yourself. No, the, no, there's one to there's the right. Oh, oh, let's go. Nice, nice good nice. cover. Ooh. I was roasted toasted. Sorry, Jess. It's all good. That was a very rude rocket rip. I even had a wall up between, that, but like a little tiny gap under it. That rocket made me very upset. It was incredibly rude. To, that's like... To waste a rocket on a downed boy is yeah. like how how often do you even get a rocket launcher that you're willing to just throw one of the ammo away to get a an easy kill you already have? Yeah, and it wasn't like he wasn't taking fire. Like I I, I would like maybe understand if he knew I was alone, but I can't. Oh, we gotta yeah, we gotta go. Oh. We gotta go. I can't go, even go. talk about it oh, anymore. No. <laughs> Highly upset. <laughs> they don't have a jump pad by chance. Uh, let me check, but I think not. No. Did anyone pick up the cozy that was there? No, I didn't see it. I got it. Yeah, I battle. got it. I got it. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> this is gonna hurt. We gonna make it? Uh, dude, dude, go to Dusty, grab some moon rocks. Oh, let's go. This is Justin's legacy. <laughs> I don't know. That's pretty off. Uh, path. How it's many a, are you gonna eat, Ryan? Yo, just one. Oh, okay. Just one rock. <laughs> all I you thought need. if you eat more, you get, like, benefits. You get the challenge, if that's what okay. you're asking. How do you do it? You <laughs> start jumping? Yeah, yeah. Just just run, but then press space every time you touch the ground. And then when you pass Mal, throw a boogie ball on his feet so he dies <laughs> in the floor. <laughs> How long no. do, they, do they last for? Like, uh, 20 seconds or something? Oh, I'm not gonna make it. I should've started healing. I don't even have any heals and I'm gonna die. No. Oh, you're so close too. Oh! Oh no, I was literally like Justin. half a second. <laughs> Dan. Are you just sitting on the campfire? Because I'm, I'm healing, I'm healing, I'm healing. Look at <laughs> Oh my goodness. It's a chokeable jug! That was insane. I, if I had to start it two seconds earlier. Dang it. I don't think so, boys. That is a rough one. That, that pains me. A great yeah. deal. Oh, buddy. Come on now. Come on, Schwartz. Uh, this is like too close to call. I'm sorry, Dan. No. No. Ten. Six. <laughs> oh, no. no. <laughs> there are only six left oh. on the finish line. All we had to do was make it. Brutal. I'm going to Cersei mode. <laughs> you think that's some kind of joke? Cersei? She deserves the wings. You know what? It's a good time to act a skin change. I've been having good luck with the Thor skin. 
<laughs> what do you think he's got in that side pocket? <laughs> oh, a Betamax player? Yeah. <laughs> he's got uh, Masters of the Universe on <laughs> Laserdisc and a uh, pocket full of prophylactics. Who, uh, who starred in Masters of the Universe? I know that. Dolph Lundgren. He's done it. Who else is in that movie? Oh, no idea. Courtney Cox. Really? Yeah, she's... Does she? Yeah. S same way Robin Wright was in Princess Bride. Yeah, but she was. She was. So like, no, no, she wasn't. Just go to IMDb right now, Dan. It's your favorite website, dangeasling.com slash movies. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now I'm open to... Yeah, yeah I was just going to say. Here Whoa. Damn. Wow, stuff happening here. <laughs> no, you're a madman. See you guys in Pandaria. <laughs> have you guys seen Ready Player One? No, I have not. I think it's probably out of theaters by now, don't you think? Yeah. Um, no, it's in theaters. It's in theaters. It, you know, this is like it's slightly inside baseball, but it was probably benefited by the fact that after Infinity War, nobody released anything for two weeks. Really? Yeah. Nothing wide, at least. And then, like, uh,. I mean, we're recording so your, this. Your mom wasn't at the movie theater. <laughs> oh, wow. No, she was not released from the hospital. <laughs> they didn't release her from the zoo either, I bet. <laughs> um, but yeah, like, Infinity War came out and, like, nothing competed with it. And then uh, the next week, nothing competed with it. And even the week after that, I think nothing. And then the week after that, Deadpool comes out. Huh. Yeah. So they're like, we're just gonna give it like a month of it being by itself. Wait, no, isn't what's Deadpool? What's oh, uh, Ant Man's in July, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How do they keep all those stories straight? Kevin Feige. Pretty. One guy did it all. Yep. Well, he's I all mean, the, he's, he's all the men. He just reads the comics. Big deal. Yeah. <laughs> he re he's the most valuable person on Earth right now because he takes the comics and he goes, eh, this comic, the story is really cool. There's a bunch of like nerd shit in here that like mainstream audiences will never eat up and understand. So what if we just sanitize that and like make it all 100% cool? And then he just does it. I could do it though. <laughs> Dude, please do. Kevin. <laughs> Step aside. <laughs> like, I'll admit, when before Ant Man came out, so we're talking like three years ago, I was like, how are they going to do Ant Man? His power is that he's small. Wow, amazing. That uh, sounds like a real. <laughs> well, yeah, but not in the first. Also, movie. in the comics, Hank Pym invented Ultron. Um. <laughs> So it's not like this is what this is why you need a Kevin. That's why you need a Kevin to be there and be like, this stuff doesn't matter. Just make him a guy that gets really small, and then occasionally, like things get big around him, and it's really cool. Oh, if I didn't know you're a big comic book guy, uh, I spent like the last couple of years just watching every comics explained. Ah, uh, you're like a bandwagon guy. <laughs> no, <laughs> really. I mean, I've always. Wow. Damn. I've always been well, watching the, the Marvel movies and stuff, and I've, in general, always liked comic characters and universes and stuff my whole life, but um, every once in a while, I'd be like, I'd have... I'd want to go deeper into the characters and stuff, but I also don't want to buy, like, 50 years worth of comics, so... Yeah. I feel you on that. Why not? <laughs> because I don't think... I would be able to. It's like, you know. Where is everyone? Yeah, I'm still I'm over here. Lucky breaking benches open. I guess I should bounce. <laughs> I followed that. Whoa, I just shot a gun on accident. I was just following mouth. I don't, I don't think anyone would, would be down here. <gasps> oh, who's your favorite comic book guy? Ant-Man? Um, not Ant-Man. Um, ask me again in a bit. I gotta think about it. Dude, I gotta be honest. The origin movie was like, I know Justin's not a big fan. I'd oh. say it's like a seven. 
But after Infinity War, I'm like, this Doctor Strange guy's got a good head on his shoulders. Hmm. He's got a lot of interesting stuff going on. Doctor Strange is dope. It's a cart which is dope. But I think World Breaker Hulk is like my favorite thing ever. Have you ever read the comic where uh, Hulk has populated the rest of planet Earth with uh, he and She-Hulk's descendants, and then Wolverine has to navigate a world full of redneck Hulk and She-Hulk <laughs> spawn? That it's old called. Man it's called Old Man Logan. Yeah. They <laughs> Kevin Feige came out, turned it into Logan. Ninety-four percent on Rotten Tomatoes, Best Picture nominee. <laughs> he didn't That's have anything to, to do with that. So. He was there, he was worm tongue in the shadows, saying, "Hey, get rid of that whole <laughs> she hole. Hey, what if you made the rednecks not have green skin? No. I think it'll be a more universal." What's that? That vending machine. Um, there is a <laughs> a tacti. Uh, 200 wood, you get a green hunter. 200 brick, you get a green tacti. 200 steel, you get a green tacti. Wait. I wish. Yeah, they can have two of the same thing. Oh, they sorry, green pumper. But, you know, I guess it's all academic at this point. Okay. Oh, uh, I also really want Marvel to do something with Sentry at some point. But they probably won't because it's hard. Did you guys see, like, uh, everybody was against the Disney-Fox merger? They were like, oh, it's very troubling that Disney owns, you know, so many of the media properties that we know and love. Oh. And then this week, um, Comcast oh, was like, we're putting in a competing bid, and everyone was like, please, Disney. That, that, that <laughs> finish <bottle>. the deal. <laughs> that bottle sip right here. Ooh. Yeah, I'll grab yeah, that. Uh, Comcast, and there was one other company... I Wallet. think it was another telecom that also wanted to... Shaw? Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be sick, though, dude. I could watch X-Men Apocalypse for eight ninety nine on pay-per-view. <laughs> All right, Dan. <laughs> I, had a, I have a sip stack, so I was just carrying for the team. I'm serious. It was the mini bullets. I need them for my. Oh, here I got you. No, I don't actually need them. <laughs> Fiend right? definitely needed. It's it's the thought that hurts though. Uh, does anyone have extra rockets? They do not need. Uh, I have no. Rockets. I got dos puntos. Zero. You guys just like leaving them on the ground if you don't need them, or are you just? No, I just haven't. I haven't moved a whole lot. Cause like you know, you get infinite space for ammunition. Yeah. Oh, you got one. You tell me. I always pick up every bit of ammunition. Yeah, sure. Unless Dan comes in and steals some, or sometimes. <laughs> oh. Well. More green pumps here. Hey, 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 hey. What? <laughs> All right, boys, 44 alive. Not a lot of action. I think I have the worst inventory I've had in the entire night. Oh, no. It's I have your best game. You ready? Mm -hmm. Gray Bursty with 40 bullets. <laughs> now we're getting to the good stuff. Blue Thunker, 12 grenades. Ooh. Nothing wrong with that. 10 default proletariat hand-thrown grenades. <laughs> 10 bandages. And then a stack of little sips. Go ahead, ask me the stack size. Two. Stack size. One. <laughs> this is a cursed inventory. I mean, you, you kind of lost my the battle in my eyes when you said twelve pumpers. Like I do, I have a. I don't even have a shotgun. See, building three thirteen. Yep, it's it's fresh. Ryan, oh, they're shooting at me. Shoot I didn't even out. shoot at them. Alright, I'm behind Justin, so I can't. I've got pump rockets him, for you, Ryan. This so way? Pick some up. I'm coming around with Justin, because if I can get a height, I can use my thumb. They're, they're trying to push you a little bit on us, Melf. It's on that first hill. Oh, one guy sees me. There's a care package. Yep, there's right one here. there's one coming right to you, Justin. You should flank you should. him. He won't doesn't see you. It's front of the rock. Nice. I nailed him. I hit one, he's got no shield. Nice job. 
Oh, he's hurt. Uh, hurt. I got pushed up. Try to help out. My grenade, I swear, it bounced off your head. <laughs> I'm down. Oh. Yeah, we're down. How many? Right, <laughs> Ryan? Just one, one up I right think. now. No! Right there. He's up top. Uh... No! Oh, God. <laughs> I should have had him. I feel bad. Oh, man. E oh. Well, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, click the like button. Also, a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.